welcome back to the Quantum Conundrum. This game is still awesome. And just so you know, once again, second time playing this level. This one is called the Mad Ladder. And if you're wondering why this is the second time I'm playing this level, yeah, this time it's all on me. Really. The entire reason I'm replaying this level is because I made the simple, foolish mistake of accidentally doing, of accidentally making a mistake. Yeah, this is going to be difficult. So I need two safes. So yeah, that one's not going to cut it. Ah, jeez. That guy with the laser, he's a bot bot. I have no clue what that stands for. I just know it's cool that they actually decided to name their robots bot bots. So, now, I need to get one of those over here. Or at least one of them. There we go. Now with that one being blocked, I can go over here and use this one as a step up. <coughs> okay. I'm curious as to what's down this way. Oh, just a view of this area. Oh yes, I remember this. Yes, this 
ITS device, running the dinosaur is actually reasonable. <laughs> ah. <laughs> we can assume. There we go. The moving is also an annoying noise generator. Gravity canister check. Press button to open door and it holds open. Check. Now, ah, there we go. There's the annoying noise generator. Yes, got it. Bots. They're the main antagonist in Ikakurama. And yes, that is the name of the other DLC. Okay, that is a super cool object that is a spheroid of some sort. Basically, if you get it into a vat. Not expecting that to destroy it. <sighs> okay, so you see that bat over there? Get this in there. Yep, it's in. It's so in. Wait, oh yes, right. Now. Nope. Fail. Guess that number 41, if I read that number correctly as being number 40, is lying about your weight to yourself. Okay. So. Oh, okay. So now that I'm over here. I don't care about time or shifts. I just want this done. This level I haven't actually completed yet. This is actually as far as I went, got before Easy Bits stopped recording because of my because of my mistake. So this is as far as I got before. I've never done this part before. Now 
you know just how newbie I am.
Okay, why on earth did that one explode? Anyone who's played this game, if you can provide a plausible reason for that one exploding, but with me being able to have one last long enough to fly to the other side, I would be much appreciative of that. Conundrum. <laughs> Quite the conundrum getting through this level. I was right about number 41. <laughs>
another random explosion of an orb. Yep. Falling tiny of the woods beyond the next door because it's really cool and you now you dead and you dead, won't get to know now. <laughs> yep, this game is really a blast. Denying a home for this person the spare chains you really do have. I think from the other I think for the rest of this level my commentary will only be able to be the death messages because that's really only, the only idea I have left. Did I honestly get saved because I'm here? a shortcut. Hopefully. Hopefully it works. Nope. It didn't work. I'm so utterly horrible at this. I will probably never succeed. There aren't any lasers. Okay. I did not manage. <sighs> Why do those orbs keep exploding spontaneously? Oh, that's the phone. Um, hello? That, I'm going to complain about the lack of flying cars. Why can't flower cars fly yet? Come on, we've had years to work on this sort of thing. We've had planes for who knows how. I think about a I think a hundred years, I'm not sure. Still haven't gone to college, I'm only in high school. Level. Yes! Okay. Now with that complete, I have to say thank you for watching and goodbye. <laughs>